More than 58,000 names. Lily Jenkins Johnson drawn to one of them. It make tears come to my eyes one thing. March 5th, 1970, her husband was killed. A wife and six children left behind. Beatty, McCary, Holmes. Willie Johnson was one of 21 service members from Oconee County who never made it back home from Vietnam. Now 81 years old, Lily hasn't been able to travel to see the permanent memorial. Here, she doesn't have to. The Army was uh, what he loved to do. He loved being in the Army. It's a path to healing. That's why the Oconee County Veterans Affairs Office worked for three years to get the Vietnam moving wall here. Hundreds welcome the wall at the Blue Ridge Electric Co-op off Highway 11, where it will be displayed through Monday. For Betty Rowland, it's a way to honor her brother, Fred Smith. Oh, I'm so proud of it. For so many Vietnam veterans, this wall means so much. When I came back, there was no thank you for serving. There was no pat on the back or anything. You wanted to get out of uniform as quick as you could. Now people come up and pat you on the back and say thank you. And that means a lot. A sense of pride for those who served and for those who sacrificed. It's been hard, but Lord brought me through. A way to show they're never forgotten. Mandy Gaither, WYFF News 4 in Oconee County.